hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i have for you guys a requested video so today is going to be a what's in my purse and so let me start off by showing you my purse the purse that i have the request on is uh my michael kors handbag that i showed in i think i showed in my christmas what i got for christmas and i have posted outfits of the days using um this handbag so this is what the handbag looks like it's black with gold and then it has the gold detailing on the sides which is my favorite part of this bag um this is a large the selma large satchel um and i tried looking for it online for you guys i can't find it anymore there's similar styles um without this detail on them and so you can check you know those purses out but this one i was really i really fell in love with it mainly because it is black and gold which are my favorite colors to wear um and i really like that it has both colors and it's very simple yet classy and nice so yeah so let's start off um I think I've said this in previous uh, what's in my bag or what's in my purse videos. I don't like a messy bag. I don't really like to have a messy bag. Like inside, I don't like to have a change falling out or receipts or any like extra crap. I don't like to have it. Um, I keep everything in little individual bags. And even though it seems like it's more stuff i know where everything is at and everything's organized so i don't have to be like rummaging through the bag when i'm you know at the store or something like that so yeah so i will just give you a quick overview of what it looks like which looks pretty um organized and i guess i mean that's just how i am i just can't help it um, so I'm just going to start pulling out things. The first thing is my wallet. This is actually a new wallet and I really like the color for summer. It's kind of like a orangey coral. Definitely more orangey. Um, and then it just has these details right here and the zipper in the back. And it just opens like this. So that's that. Next I'm going to pull out. So when I carry my camera, um, I carry it in this little pouch, which is a Hello Kitty uh, camera bag that I've showed um, in other videos. And this is what it looks like. So I carry my camera in here. Um, next is, let's start off, I guess, with the little pouches. The first one I have is this one. It's kind of like a, a rose gold silver pink and um it's from victoria's secret i think it's like very old and in here this is an overview of what i carry so i like to be prepared and i like to have um things that i think sometimes i might need or something like that so in each of my handbags there's always hand sanitizer i can't live without hand sanitizer um you know some people are just gross and I always carry hand sanitizer. Then I have a roll-on perfume, and this is from Hello Kitty Big Pink Bow. Looks like this. It smells really good. Then I have another one, which is a mini one. It's a very sexy from Victoria's Secrets. My favorite perfume from Victoria's Secrets of all time. And then I have another little roll-on perfume, and this is by Vera Wang, Love Struck. And I also carry a lotion, and this is from Bath & Body Works, and it's called Be Enchanted. I also carry some hair ties, a small clip, some more little clippies for the hair, and the very bottom there are some bobby pins. So that's just in case, you know, when my hair is down, or it just depends. But I like to carry everything in here, you know, sometimes maybe, you know, in case of perfume spills or lotion, it doesn't ruin my bag or any of my other bags. 
The next one, this is a Hot Pink Guess um, makeup bag. And I got this for Christmas as well. So I forgot to mention that my purse, I got it for Christmas as a gift um, for my hubby. So in here, this is what it looks like. It's pretty basic. There's not a lot of things. Um, I always carry this Hello Kitty mirror because it's just super cute. Um, my Stay Matte powder from Rimmel, which is the one I use. My Real Techniques buffing brush because that's what I apply my powder with some tweezers and my Urban Decay D Slick makeup setting spray. I don't carry a lot of makeup because I don't feel like uh, I need to carry blush if I already applied it before I left the house. I don't feel I need to carry eyeshadow or any other uh, random uh, makeup that obviously I won't be using. Um, sometimes I do carry eyeliner uh, in case, you know, because that does fade throughout the day. Um, my blush and highlight and bronzer and you know that just pretty much stays the same the whole day um, until I come home and I'm going to remove my makeup. The next thing I have is this little bag that says Makeup Queen and um, I found this bag at Nordstrom Rack. Super cute and it was really cheap and I really liked it. It's purple and gold. And in here, that's what it looks like. This is my lip bag um, and I pretty much carry so I basically carry one lip gloss which has lately um, and for the past few months been the NYX butter gloss in cupcake which looks like this and I carry this this goes from bag to bag I carry this lip gloss in case I'm you know one day I just run out in a hurry and I just want to pop something on my lips so I won't look so plain um, and an extra lipstick. The lip, the extra lipstick is usually a different one. It could be a nude one, red, burgundy, um, pink, whatever. The, in this case, it's the Lorac lipstick from the Alter Ego collection in the color Showgirl, which has been one of my favorite lipsticks. And then I carry what is on my lips, what I'm wearing that day. Um, whether it be, you know, three products, three lip products, four, or just one, that's what I carry in here. So for today, I have a lip liner from NYX in, in the color Plum, which is almost gone because it's my favorite uh, lip pencil. And then I have the lipstick I'm wearing, which is from the Riri collection from MAC, and this is Riri Woo. So that's what I'm carrying. Now, Everything that's left in here, okay, so I'm gonna go on to the side pockets. On the side pocket, I like to carry my phone because I hate when it goes uh, all the way to the bottom and I can't find it when, you know, I get a phone call or something. And then the side pocket, I just have gum and tissues, just Kleenex, just in case anything. And then the very bottom, which actually isn't at the very bottom, it was standing up, is, uh, the iPad and that's actually um, my hubby's iPad but since I always carry it for her um, it's always in my bag or in any other bag you know in case she gets bored wherever we go or sometimes you know I get bored and I use it so that's pretty much it and um, that's pretty much all I carry in my bag I don't like to carry extra junk let me check um, yeah, that's about it. And then on the other side, there's just the Michael Kors, um, little note on the leather of the bag and stuff. And yeah, I really, really enjoy this bag. It's a perfect size for me because it's huge. And as you can see, I carry a lot of crap, um, which is why I don't like to carry excess crap. If I get a receipt, it goes in my wallet every two to three days. I like to clear out all the receipts that I don't really need anymore or that are trash, you know. And if I need a receipt, I put it away um, in case I'm going to return something. Um, and yeah, I pretty much, uh, um, how do I say it? I pretty much, if I'm not using this purse, which is the one I'm using at the moment, but when I change my purse, all I do, all I have to do is pretty much just um, 
move these three bags and change my purse so if i want to change my purse on a daily basis um like according to my outfit it's so much easier than having to pick and choose through all the crap that you might have if there's like a huge mess i'm just so anal about that so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed this um what's in my purse video and if you guys have any requests for any more videos please leave them in the comment section i write uh, as soon as i see them i write them down on my notebook and they're all coming you know i just can't do them all you know in one one sitting so yeah but you know whatever your requests will be coming i have them all uh written down in my notebook and i'm just going down the list through all the requests i have so yeah thank you so much for all your guys support i really really appreciate it it means you know so much to me and i am super excited to be like 20 subscribers away from a thousand which is very exciting for me um and i'm very happy and i will continue to work hard and have more videos for you guys so yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video